This basic kid story book has earned over $232,000 in passive income from Amazon. Today, I will start a similar business in front of you with the help of AI. We will begin by creating a book idea, writing the story and making beautiful illustration all with the help of artificial intelligence. If you want to earn passive income then keep watching this video until the end. I promise you will find lots of valuable information that you won't find anywhere else. I came across to this idea while looking through Amazon for possible ways to earn money without much effort. That is when I found about the children's storybook product. At first, it may seem like a regular book but after doing some research, I was amazed by the profit of these sellers made by selling such simple storybooks. For instance, this book received 2968 ratings. If I multiply by 14.16 which is the price of this book, you can observe that the seller has earned more than $42,000 from just that book. Let's see another example. This book have received 17156 ratings. If I multiply that by $5.82, I can see that the seller has earned profit over $99,000 from that book alone. And this seller has made over $48,000 in total. Also, as we discussed earlier, with 33,305 ratings and with a price of 6.99, this seller made at least $232,000. And remember guys, only about 25 customers end up writing reviews for every thousand sales. So this single storybook may have made this man a billionaire. Can you imagine? The most unbelievable part is that I can publish these books absolutely free of cost using Amazon KDP. So I came up with the idea of creating a similar ebook using ChatGPT and then publishing it on Amazon to earn money effortlessly while I sleep. So I decided to make this video to help as many people as I can in earning money with this less known method. When it comes to creating an excellent children's storybook, we should begin with a good story concept. Therefore, I asked ChatGPT to help me in generating an amazing title for a children's storybook. The first title it gave me was The Magical Adventure of Oliver and the Enchanted Forest. That's alright, but I believe we could create something even more thrilling. So after a few more attempts, I finally came up with a title The Extraordinary Adventure of Penny and the Magic Carousel. That sounds like a nice title which I can use. Afterwards, I asked the chat word for additional details about the storybook. It recommended that the book would be ideal for kids aged 6 to 10 and would revolve around a young girl named Penny on an incredible journey. One day while exploring her grandmother's attic, Penny stumbles upon an old dusty carousel. I really liked the concept and decided to go ahead with it. The next thing I did was to outline the story. The chatbot provided me a series of chapters and scenes for each chapter. The Mysterious Attic Chapter 2 A Carousel Ride to a Fantasy Land Chapter 3 Soaring with Dragons Chapter 4 The Mermaid's Secret Chapter 5 The Forest of Whisper and so on. Now that I have the list of chapters, I can begin writing the actual story using each chapter as a guide. To do this, simply copy the first chapter and paste it into ChatGPT and set the prompt to write a rhyming story. The chatbot will then create a story based on that chapter outline. If you are not satisfied with the results, you can generate a new story until you are pleased with it. So I went through the same process for each chapter. Within a short time, I had the complete story ready to be turned into a book. This book has the potential to generate passive income without requiring me to write anything from scratch. It's truly remarkable how quickly I developed the story concept and outlined all the chapters. But before proceeding further, there is one important thing I need to do. So be prepared because it's pretty mind-blowing. If you have been enjoying the video so far, please give it a thumbs up. We all know that a good story requires wonderful illustration along with it. However, hiring an artist to create those illustrations can be quite expensive, ranging from hundreds to even thousands of dollars. But what if I told you that the images you are seeing right now on the screen were generated using an AI art and completely for free of charge? Would you believe it? You may be familiar with AI art and the tools used to create it. It's a method to produce unique images simply by typing in words. And that's precisely what I did to complete the first chapter of our story. Let me show you how it works. 
In the world of AI art generation, there are many options to choose from. Based on my experience, I initially started using Midjourney because it produced high quality pictures and had a free trial. However, they have now discontinued their free trial and required a paid membership. So I did some searching to find a free alternative for you. And that's when I stumbled upon Leonardo AI. It has been generating a lot of buzz in the world of AI art generation because it is considered to be just as good as Midjourney. And the best part is you can use it for free. If you want more features, you have the option to upgrade. Signing up can be a bit tricky. So let me guide you through each steps quickly. I will walk you through the steps required to create your account. First, type leonardo.ai in your browser. Once you are on the website, the website should appear similar to this. What you need to do next is click on early access right here. Then enter your email in this section and click this button. Afterwards, click this button here to join Discord. Then click here to accept their invitation. If you already have a Discord account, you can directly join their server. If you don't have the Discord account, simply create one. Download the application to your computer and then join the server. It's completely free to join. A window will then appear asking you to choose the languages you speak. You can select one or more languages and then click on next. You can skip this step if you want. Then select let me in and click on next and then click on finish. Next, I would like you to scroll down on the left hand side and click on getting started right here. Then select the language again and click on priority early access. And next, click on the form. Then click yep to redirect to a new web page. You will need to fill out the required informations properly. Like have you joined the Leonardo AI Discord? Select yes. Then add your Discord username, which you can find at the bottom right hand corner on the Discord application. Then provide the email you used to sign up for Leonardo AI. Lastly, add your first name and click submit. After submitting the form, return to Leonardo AI and click on launch app. Then click on the button that says I am whitelisted and proceed to click on the button here to log into Leonardo AI. If you used a Gmail account, then simply click here to sign in with your Gmail account. If you don't use the Gmail account, enter your email information here and click on sign in. Occasionally, there may be some technical issues that may prevent your account from being registered. If that's happened, click on the sign up and enter your email you previously used for Leonardo AI. And that's it. You are all set. Now let's pick your username and then must select at least one of your interest. And now click on next, then select which role best describes you. Then click on start using Leonardo. Now you can freely utilize Leonardo AI without any cost. You can see countless images created by other users in real time. And this platform is also much cleaner and better organized than Mid Journey, which is a positive aspect. To create your own image, you need to begin with a prompt. To do this, click on AI image generation right here. And then you can enter your prompt in this section to describe the type of image you want to create. Go back to the story chapters you generated earlier using ChatGPT and copy the first one into the prompt. In my case, it was Penny explores her grandmother's attic and discovers the dusty old carousel. Paste the text into the prompt section and include kid's storybook after a comma so the AI knows the desired art style. After that, simply click on the generate button and patiently wait for the image to be generated. A row of images will be then generated right here. Now I want to let you know that the free version of Leonardo AI lets you create only 150 images and it resets every 8 hours. To make most out of the free version, I suggest you choosing a lower number of images per prompt. This way you can gather a larger collection of images to be used for your storybook. You can see here are the 4 images that have been generated for us. Simply choose your favorite one and download it by clicking on the download image button located right here. This action will open a new page. Then right click on the image and select save image as to save it onto your device. If you want to make any edits to your images such as removing specific elements or making adjustment, simply click on this button right here labeled edit in canvas. This will redirect you in a new page where you can make the desired changes. 
Now let's say you wish to create a new image featuring the same character as your first image. Here's a simple tip. If the character in your storybook don't have names, you can create names for them. I already have the character named Penny. The next step is to provide more information about them, such as their appearance or age if needed. In my case, I will specify it as a human child by mentioning Penny, the 8-year-old girl, at the beginning of each prompt. So let's grab the second image of the chapter. Penny hesitantly climbs onto the carousel and feels surge of excitement as it starts spinning. I will add Penny, the human 8 years old girl. Then the rest of my prompt hesitantly climbed onto the carousel and feels a surge of excitement as it starts spinning. This is how our second image appears. So I went through this process for the all images I wanted to make and within 20 minutes, I had all of my illustrations ready to use. I won't go through the process for each chapter since it would be time consuming. But I hope you had the concept. Simply tackle each section individually and create images based on your topic. After generating all the images, now I will show you how to create beautiful storybook by combining the text generated by ChatGPT and the images generated by Leonardo AI. Begin by visiting canva.com and search for storybook and press enter. Next, create an empty storybook by clicking on the plus icon and upload the AI generated images into it. I can easily add my first image to the template by dragging and dropping it. Then navigate to the chat GPT, copy the first part of your story and paste it onto the image. Customize the text to your liking by adjusting color, font style and adding effects like shadow and more. Once you are done, make a copy of the template to add a new image while maintaining the consistent style. Repeat this process for all the chapters of the book. Lastly, I will save my book as PDF and boom, I have successfully crafted my own storybook ready to sell on Amazon. To summarize briefly, here are the steps you should follow. Start by using ChatGPT to generate your idea. Create an outline for your story and divide it into chapters. Utilize the art generator from Leonardo AI to create illustrations. Combine the text with the images using Canva and save the final product as a PDF. Finally, upload your storybook to Amazon KDP to start earning passive income. You can easily find tons of YouTube tutorials that provide step-by-step -step instruction on how to publish your own ebook on Amazon. Now, if you want to make an animated version of the same story and want to make millions by selling it to your clients as a complete beginner, then you must watch this video right here. But before that, like this video and subscribe to this channel and let's meet in the next video.